Hey guys, I'm Otto from Everything Amiibo, and I'm about to unbox the Oculus Rift Development Kit 2 and show you guys exactly what's inside this box. That's right guys, I know it's hard to believe, I'm struggling to believe it myself, but we do indeed have in the studio an Oculus Rift development kit. Oh my gosh, this does contain the actual thing, by the way, development kit doesn't mean not play kit, <laughs> just for the record, before you see it unboxed. But yeah, I should have some other stuff before this on my channel about it. I don't know, maybe not. But if you don't know, I have an Oculus Rift now, and I'm going to be doing tons of videos, so make sure you stay tuned for that. Without further ado, let's see exactly what's inside of here. We'll go over all of the components in here, if we can get it open. All right, so on the back, you just very simply slide it open. This is, uh, this is pre-owned, so it does have everything, all the original stuff in it but it's not going to be in the original packaging, etc. Okay. Oh my gosh. So the first thing that we have here is the actual Oculus Rift headset. So on the top of it is the uh, U uh, sorry HDMI cord and USB cord here. I believe the USB is for power. And then we have the actual headset. There's the um, actual lens bit. We will set that aside and we'll put it back up at the end remind you of everything that's in here. Then we have the camera, which is new to the development kit too, to track your head motion a lot better. And this will go down here as well. Next we have the uh, mains charger for the, uh, I'm not sure, hopefully that's for the actual headset. I'd rather not plug in a USB to my um, computer to power it, but I think that is what's going to have to happen. And here we have a uh, mini USB to USB, which is probably some sort of data transfer cable. We'll find out what that does at some point. Maybe not in this video. I'm just showing you guys exactly what's in here. And then we have a an HDMI to DVI, I believe this is called, slash DVI to HDMI. I'm not sure wh which way around that goes. Then we have a 3.5 millimeter audio cable, probably for transferring audio, um, to the Oculus Rift. Um, what looks like maybe some spare lenses. Oops. Um, there's another one. And we have an adapter for American plugs. We're not going to need that. I live in Scotland, if you didn't know that already. Everybody's favorite piece of unboxings, the do not eat stuff. I'm going to throw that away actually as well. Um, a Australian, maybe it's European plug adapter. Again, we're not going to need that because we are in the UK here, baby. And there's another plug adapter. You don't need to see that. And one more plug adapter. You can see that one. All right, right at the bottom here, we have a DK2 quick start guide, which is probably going to be really important considering this is pretty uh, DIY. And then we have, it's quite a nice box because it has this foam thing to hold everything in. And then there's nothing left. And if you didn't see already, there's foam at the top here to protect everything. So we'll go ahead and throw the foam thing back in the box. And we will set everything up and quickly show you guys again what's inside the Oculus Rift uh, DK2 box. All right, guys, just to summarize, you, of course, get the Oculus Rift headset, the DVI to HDMI converter, this little lens cleaner here, what seems to be two spare lenses, the new camera to track your head, a bunch of country, like, adapters for the mains plug, so don't worry about that, depend, uh, wherever your country is. We've got a 3.5 millimeter audio jack. We've got the HDMI and USB connections on the back of the Oculus Rift. We have the DK2 quick start manual which is falling over so I'll put that away. We have what is probably a data transfer cable which is mini USB to USB and we have a mains power cord. Here. So that's 
all that's inside here. Make sure you do, of course, stay tuned to everything Amiibo for a ton, and I mean a ton, of Oculus Rift Development Kit 2 videos, mostly themed on Nintendo stuff and awesome stuff like that. So, yeah, subscribe, and if you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave a like. I'll see you guys later.